डू यू स्ट्रगल विद मैनेजिंग टाइम इन मॉक टेस्ट यस डोंट वरी most of the students who are preparing for neat exam struggle with this fact why because you have to attempt 200 questions in 200 minutes it is not easy and out of this you can leave some questions but you still have to attempt 180 questions now first thing that you need to understand is it is okay if you are struggling it is okay if you are struggling most of the students struggle right the second thing which is important to understand is you need stamina for 200 minutes most of the students would not be able to think beyond one hour then you will not be able to perform properly in the exam so you have to build stamina to sit at a place write the exam for 200 minutes all of this will come with practice it is not going to happen by itself you are going to write more and more tests you will develop more and more stamina so this was the second thing now please understand what we are going to do till this time i have told you that before mock test you have to revise in my last video i had told you how to revise what material to use where you should not spend your time in this video i am trying to tell you when you are writing the mock test how to optimize your performance during mock test because what will happen is if you are not going to do that you will incur silly mistakes you will not be able to complete the paper you will feel a lot of pressure so the answer to this problem is what i call run to the end strategy what is run to the end strategy most of the students when they start writing the exam they take a lot of time on questions in the beginning they try and make sure that everything that they are doing they are attempting it as much time as taken they are trying to get it right that should not happen the simple rule should be if you are not able to solve any question within 30 seconds mark a circle move forward mark a circle move forward keep marking circles your first attempt should be to reach to 200 question at the earliest possible after that you should come back and attempt all those questions which you had circled this will save a lot of time otherwise what happens is for example biology need 2022 most of the students think that they are very good in biology so when students found a very difficult paper they started spending a lot of time trying to get questions right and in that process they ended up losing out marks in physics and chemistry despite the fact that physics and chemistry was very very easy those students who followed this run to the end strategy they did not struggle with this problem because they kept marking circles in biology questions and then physics and chemistry was easy they were able to finish it quickly they were able to come back and attempt all the biology questions so this is something which is very very important if you see on the screen start with physics first question keep attempting questions and keep marking circles for all those questions which you don't understand and you have to follow the same rule after every subject you should fill omr so after physics after chemistry then biology then biology two portions of biology and then come back and attempt all the circle questions so then fill the omr fifth time this is the best strategy possible guys this is very very important if you are writing an exam in which you have to attempt 200 questions in 200 minutes you can't waste time spending on a particular question you can't spend 5 minutes 6 minutes 7 minute on a question what will this result into you will find at the end 30 questions of physics remaining and you have 12 minutes you will not be able to finish the paper then you will try and do in fast and a lot of silly mistakes would happen but if you start following this run to the end strategy which i just explained all of these things will not happen so what i want from you A have you understood this video if you haven't understood ask me in the comment section B promise me on this sunday in our first test of classroom test series which is a bonus test on 22nd september you are going to apply run to the end strategy it is very very important that you apply it now and then you apply it next sunday 29 september our first classroom test in 200 plus centers all over the country if you start applying this strategy you will find your mock test score significantly improve all right students